Tonight, complaints, questions, and a lot of Monday evening quarterbacking now that Ultra Music Festival has come and gone for this year. By some accounts, its new location was a success. By others, especially from people who live nearby, it was a major headache. CBS 4's Hank Tester is live tonight with Reaction. Hank? Elliot, can you hear the quiet? There is Ultra right across the street. All dark tonight. Well, folks at Key Biscayne, the village of Key Biscayne leadership, be, they will be meeting on April the 9th. Meanwhile, two mayors here in our area, they have questions about Ultra. Let's take a look. It is loud, intense, packed with fans, logistically had some ugly moments, some arrest. Okay. New location, Virginia Key. Critics say Ultra gummed up the one road in and out of Key Biscayne. You got one way in, one way out, and you got 60,000 people, so that's what it was. So how did the high-energy, base-driven event go down on low-key Key Biscayne? They were in any big trouble around our village, but hopefully they take it somewhere else next year. And others just did not like it at all. Like, it's totally ridiculous. Like, my family, like, hates it so much, we went to Orlando for the weekend. So how about next year? The mayor of Key Biscayne, whose residents were impacted by traffic congestion, just wishes it would go away. People were delayed. Uh, people, you know, trying to get to the airport or trying to get back from the airport. It was, it, they, they were inconvenienced. I think that's a fair thing to say about the traffic. Held by the sea breeze, folks on Key Biscayne did not hear much of a pulsating bass, but you could sure hear it on the mainland. And Miami's mayor, who's a big supporter of Ultra, was not happy. I let the organizers know before the event and let them know during the event um, and I'm certainly going to let them know after the event that low frequency base uh, penetrating miles into the city of Miami is not acceptable. I, I live seven miles away and I can hear it in my house. It's something that's a big problem and uh, it's a non-negotiable for me. Ultra set to go in 2020. You want the dates right now, Elliot? I can tell you March 27th, 28th and 29th. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News tonight. Back to you.